coming at you live. Coming at you. The space between space research. We are space ebler. Space ebler. I'm live now. Space between space research. I could I could broadcast a private conversation to the internet with these fucking weirdos. But I'm not going to. Those weirdos I call my friends. Um yeah, so here we are. Uh what I really want to do <clears throat> I wanted to use like the I've been uh for generative music. I want to use the um the drum sequencer for probabilistic shit and uh the quadruple note generator. I think I'm going to start with the drum sequencer because there's a lot of really cool things you can do with it, not just for drums. Uh but we're going to yeah, so you like I like to route in the uh, the MIDI from a different channel, and then like route it into my uh my thing the jig. So we're gonna start with uh thinking Kong or Redrum, but maybe I should use the the realistic drummer thing. Nah, nah. Let's go with a uh, let's go with Kong drum designer now yeah then just route the midi through reason rack plug in and then uh play the so that's that's playing the the other drum over here oh what's up the real infinity one coming at us live Yeah, but I'm gonna change this drum sound though. Down tempo. Pop. Charuse. Basic two. Best of the rest. We're gonna go with basic two, but what's really cool about this uh this player over here. Oh yeah, they got all these presets and shit too. But I was just gonna do my own, but let me see here. Oh that's really convenient. But yeah, we're gonna go back to default because I just want to do like uh, the probabilistic shiznits here. I want it to be more like uh, techno though, but we're gonna slow it. Yeah, so that's really quiet because I need to put like a the drum bus on the on the drums, and then uh, the drum bus. Is like a magical device. Oh, my headphones are really quiet. Are too quiet. Let's turn my headphones up. Yeah. The yeah, others. A kick drum. So we're gonna make it so like the probability of me hitting a hi hat. All over the place, different probabilities. So, if this one hits, we get like a glitchy stutter effect. Number five, I like to use uh, prime numbers, are, are good for probabilistic music. But if we want to get these poly rhythms going. So 
actually what I was thinking of doing too. Uh, take the MIDI. Alright, I'm not sure if that'll work actually. Sub streaming pirate, the real Infinati one. I've been working a lot of like generative kind of music lately. Or probabilistic music. Probably should have saved that thing I did last time, huh? Wait here, whatever. So that's pattern five, but so pattern one is just gonna be like we're gonna experiment with polyrhythms. Every seven notes, we get a kick drum. I don't really like the sound of that snare, though. Here, let's use a clap instead. So every ten beats. We clap our hands every 10 beats. And every 13 beats. This restarts, but I'm going to adjust the probability for each one of these hi-hat notes. Let's make these like so we won't hit every seven beats under like 85% probability. Same with the clap. What are you guys chatting on Discord? I don't know where the voice chat is on Discord, I don't see it. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, here's the voice chat. Okay, I see now. Hello? So wait, yeah, Dave, did you, Dave, did you give up masturbation? Oh, uh, Spacey is on. Hold on so, um, yeah. 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 What? You didn't give up I have to connect on my computer. Wait, am I am I looping back on you guys? No, I don't think no, you're looping. Wait, wait, what am I looping back? Dave needs to fix his shit. Because no, like, I'm trying to or wait, or wait, or, or, or wait, or wait, is that you that I'm feeding back through? I'm trying to figure out how to turn the. It's probably me. Okay. Uh, uh, hold on. Dave. Dave. What? You can't turn yeah. the volume down. All right, I disconnected on my phone. Can you hear me now? Yeah, no, like, I just didn't want to hear my voice. Like, fucking, you know. Through the speakers, yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Can you, Wait, you can so hear did you me give up masturbation, right? though, or just porn? Are we live streaming right now? Yeah, we're live streaming. Like, I'm broadcasting your guys' talks. Uh, yeah, I get... Yeah. Up porn. I gave up porn, but not masturbation. Oh, really? Okay. Wow. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's more healthy. Since, since I'm working out, I I stopped uh, masturbating a little bit. Yeah, Most, mostly because like it, it takes away your energy. Yeah, energy. dude, I was reading this blog post about this woman. If you only jizz like once per month or once per week, it, it, uh, actually every time you ejaculate, your uh, creative energy is dispersed. Which is really bad for somebody who's trying to be an artist. Yeah, dude, I remember like reading this blog post on Reddit where like this woman, well, I guess it's just a Reddit post, but she's all like, man, my boyfriend isn't nutting. Like, he just likes to hold it in with tantric sex, but it makes her like really frustrated. 
Uh, that's funny. Yeah, because every time they get um, the receipt. Like, 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 you know, reception, shit like come a bunch, but like, you know. Either, no like, for him. Or the, either vaginally or in the anus or in the mouth, uh, there's what? like a. There's, there's a huge reception of energy that happens for females or mm-hmm. or a gay guy who takes it in the butt. But that's that's why they're um they're uh they're, like their serotonin and dopamine goes up after that. It's part of a it's an I mean God built oh, us a certain way for a reason. Reddit twenty, you can get twenty percent off. Just and cool. I tried to quit masturbating once. So I have to set up my voice meter oh, to oh, 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 put my yeah twenty percent off. Botanical bunny, it says yeah yeah yeah. 20. So. yeah. so I gotta. I only have Reaper, so I have to set it up that way. Reaper. I, and I think Botanical bunny had thirty percent a few days ago. Oh wait, did I update my Reaper? Shit. Yeah, yeah, thirty percent discount if you use cryptocurrency. Dude, the guy must be really into crypto. I mean, I guess he could be making or losing money, you know, with crypto. I guess yeah, he probably bro. made a bunch with Bitcoin hitting nine thousand, dude. Yeah. Dude, like the funny thing about, you know, it's like it's like the stories of places that like accepted Bitcoin, you know, like pizza places. And you know they just cash it out instantly instead of holding on to it. That's what it would have been like. That's what happened to yep. um, one of my sponsors, uh, Tealit. They were like one of the first tea companies to accept Bitcoin, but they would just like cash it out right away. So they're using Bitcoin in like 2009. So they didn't like make they didn't make millions of dollars. But like, wow, wait. They were using so dude, it. what did you see that link I posted, dude? Like that your your ADA converter is now three hundred dollars brand new. Terry thinks that Bitcoin is just going to crash like instantly and be worth like absolutely nothing. Like all the virtual currencies are going to be like. I mean, it could, totally but I don't think it's, it's, it's going to happen. That'd be I awesome. It's it's buy, buy There's a, a finite amount of Bitcoin. There's not a finite yeah, amount of yeah, money. Yeah, we, we would have to see the dollar crashing a lot before that happens, is my opinion. But she just, just doesn't trust keep printing it. more money, dude. So. Yeah, that just makes the dollar go down, but... Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, you know, the reason why Bitcoin if is worth more money than the dollar is If the crash is coming, it's going to come regardless of what we do. I mean, it, did cra- it crashed. It went down to, like, $3,000, like, uh, two months ago when everything else crashed. But then it went up 3%, like, two days ago. Bit- the Bitcoin was at, like, 5000 on May 11th or 12th when I was like, now would be a good time to invest... And Bitcoin, and apparently now it's like nine thousand or some shit. Yeah, so yeah, I would have made, uh, yeah, I would have made like eighty percent profit. Yeah, I told you like, t- like uh, any pretty much anything under ten k is a good time to buy. But wait, wait, did you get your Trump up? bucks yet? Space? It could go down though. I, no, I didn't. I have, I have forty wait, did you apply for it though? Yeah, I think I had, I think I had okay. forty two. Trump bucks. Yeah, I had 42, 82, and now I have 49, joke, 25. He has nothing really to do with it, but people like just to call him Trump Bucks. You know, because he's putting his name on the Well, checks. he did sign the bill. Eh, whatever, dude. Any fucking president could have done it. Yeah, they wouldn't have put their signature on the check. I put my signature on my check on the back of it. I think it was terrible, terrible. Dude, I, dude, why can't I find any videos of Hulk Hogan DJing, though? There's just that photo of him. I mean, he, he obviously is committed if he has DJ Hogan stickers on his laptop, right? True. So I have to wrap my voice meter. Yeah. I got bored of it. To go to Discord. I don't uh, get it, but, though. Like, the my photo is the guy pointing is... at what? My Reaper is not responding. Oh, hey, so I should use a voice meter? I don't think you can use voice meter when you're using an audio interface. Oh, yeah, really? You can. Like, if you're using an Ableton. I thought you, Toby already figured out how to route yeah, Sergio. I forget how you route it. I don't know. There, there is a way to route it in and out. I forget. Didn't you connect on Sergio's computer and get it all routed? Yeah, we weren't using it. Sergio, any... did you remember how to do that? They were just using the audio interface. Oh, no. So, 
There's a way to do it in Windows too, I think. You can just go to audio devices. All right, now let me, I gotta get my Reaper working first. Yeah, hey man, can you say Air Windows Chris a bunch for me? <laughs> Are we live hey, streaming hey man. now? Yeah, well, everything Air you Windows say is, is being recorded. I, I am, hi, I am Chris J from Air Windows, and today, we have another play for you guys, for free, of course, because we don't charge for shit, because I'm Chris J from Air Windows, and oh, I was going to actually go and sample all the beginnings of the videos. He's like, hi, I'm Chris J from Air Windows. Hi, I'm Chris J from Air Windows. But yeah, it was just like way too much work. I've been super fucking lazy. But yeah, I would have done that. I mean, I'm sure he would have appreciated this, like, to a certain point, but <laughs> anything I do is mostly a nuisance to everybody. The entire universe, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I try to do less. <laughs> and then whenever I do something, I try to be a little bit more... Uh, like, I put more thought be behind something. If I'm actually going to do something, then... But I should be, like, setting up stuff. But at least right now, I'm trying to open Reaper. Windows, Chris. We should make a song about him, right? I don't know. Windows. I don't know, because, I mean, he acknowledges me, and even has acknowledged Pixelgasm, but he is unwilling to join. So, fuck him. Air Windows, Chris Garza of what? He just won't collaborate. He's like, man, I got too much going on. Can't do it. And honestly, that made me, like, not want to do shit for a while. I was like, man, you're, like, one of my best friends. Like, come on. Like, join me. Oh, that's funny. All right, I'm going to proceed to download page and get Reaper 6.09. I should also open up a new file so it doesn't take so fucking long to open. And yeah, then I can start. <clears throat> I can play at least like some sort of instrument if I route it right. Because <clears throat> last time we jammed, uh, I was just talking shit on the shitty ass phone mic while Spacey jammed with uh, Wolf Wolf Asylum from Discord, and Wolf Asylum was awesome. That really was inspiring and made me realize like yeah, that Fibonacci shit set up. That like, Fibonacci thing he did at the end was really cool, interesting. He actually went with the. Uh, um, the prime numbers. I didn't want to say anything on Facebook because you announced that it was the Fibonacci, but he went with the prime numbers, which is more interesting in a lot of ways because some of the Fibonacci numbers include eight. You know? Yeah, I was like passing out at the end. But that was awesome what we did. I, <laughs> at least from my end, of, I didn't go back and listen to it. Yeah, I skimmed through a little bit of after, but yeah, like the live the live show with with you guys on it was pretty good. I'm not sure how well the latency was though. Also, and he said he couldn't hear you. So, but I think we really need to figure out. He never said that. And I, I, I've heard that because he, um, he never said that he couldn't hear on, me. 
Yeah, he said he couldn't hear you. No, he definitely, uh, he definitely could hear me. Last week's um, uh, hangout stream with Chris J. And there was another guy on there, and I was like, yeah, we did a jam through Discord. And some random dude was like, I recommend NGAM. And I was like, yeah, we did NGAM last year. And he said it's much easier and better now. Well, I think before we do all that, you should just like prove that you can even have it set up by setting it up and, and jamming through Discord. Because like none of us, no one knows how to use an NGAM, but we all know how to use Discord. That's true. Yeah, but we all have the. Uh... We all are on yeah, Discord yeah, right now. Yeah, it's the same. The virtual banana. So like setting up basically would be the same yeah. process kind of as it would. Yeah, you're yeah, right though. So, right now I'm So if you just did that, looper. that would be like good grace period. <laughs> so we're in grace period. I agree. Yeah. So then we'd know you're serious. I kind of require you to run the show, AC Butter. What was that? Although you said, I kind of require you to run the show. Run what show? AC Butter. The whole show. Everything. It's all oh, up to you. I can only do well, so I much mean, from over here. We all have to do our part. I'll admit that. I'll do my part. I will never stop reaching out to people. And uh, hopefully I'll figure out something out tonight. I'm already drunk though, kinda. Alright, I got Reaper open. Now all I need to do is... See, a lot of people don't realize all this is built into Windows now, but it's kind of... Oh yeah, Reaper doesn't even show up. Like, the whole Windows thing is real shaky, even though they have the whole... You can route one app to another. Okay, so... Reaper doesn't even show up there. Maybe I need to close it down... Reopen. I might have to disconnect from Discord. Let me try to reopen Disc uh, Reaper first. Where are you? Where are you at, Toby? What am I doing? You mean? <clears throat> oh, was I gonna set up Ableton or something? Yeah, route it through Discord. Oh man. And then, um, uh, Sergio Blue, Sergio Blue. Yeah, I should have wrote down how I routed it before. I don't know. I'll probably just chill. It's not that hard to do. I mean, come I on. Know. You know how... Am I going to play porn movie samples? Mm. Yes. I mean, didn't you do that last time? Yeah. Are you watching porn right now? God damn. That's why I didn't want to share his no, screen. No, not. Oh, wait, Sergio, did he disconnected? It shows that he's trying to connect. No, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna take some more kratom, but hopefully I don't like cough it all up. Doesn't that take like hours to kick in? No, well, maybe like 15 minutes. For what? By kratom to kick in. Oh yeah, 15. Yeah. I don't know if I can focus enough for music. I thought we were gonna do like. Oh, a Sergio asked if we can hear his Ableton. No, we can't no, hear him. No, we can't hear you, Mike. I'm also not going to Ableton. He says. 
No, we can't hear you at all. He said he's too high. We're not high gonna Ableton. I'm not gonna Ableton. I'm not gonna Ableton. I'm not gonna Ableton. Okay. Yeah, Sergio, he could just unconnect. Oh, he just disconnected. He reconnected. Can we hear you now, Sergio? Can you hear me now, Sergio? We can hear you now. Yeah, yeah, we can. I think I'm gonna go get some Mountain Dew. I'll be back. Okay. Alright. Uh, I don't think I hear Sergio. Music, you music. didn't hear him just now? I hear his voice. Yeah, I heard his voice too. Yeah, but not Ableton, right? Oh, you're not you're not using Ableton yet? No, I think I'm gonna You have to route it. Um I'll try and route it. I have a loop going. I'm trying to figure out my shit too. Uh hold on. Reaper open, but it doesn't show up on my app volume and devices preferences. Bro, I should play a sound through the building right now. You wish what? I said I wish TGI McMonsters was open. Sounds incorporated. TGI McMonsters, I could get a burger at TGI McMonsters. Yeah, okay, you're all about those deals. Yeah. I don't know, dude. Do this, like, free kids meals from Wendy's? Give me a free kids meal from Wendy's. I love Wendy's. Oh, yeah. You, you just download Wendy's. the Wendy's app, dude. Free I know. Not really. Dude, you can really eat cheap, dude, at Wendy's. It's like $1.40 for, like, a kids meal. You get a small fry, a tiny Frosty, cheeseburger. Wow, is this an advertisement? Or, 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 or a grilled chicken wrap? Yo, I'm not sponsored right. by Wendy's. Shut the fuck up. And then, totally, like, you, you buy totally. another item for $1.40 and it's a free kids meal. Spacey free figured kids it meal. all out. Toby's got all the answers. I hate squirt patties. This is an advertisement. Yo. Be around. Join uh, Pixelgasm. I think I'm gonna die for eating Wendy's, though. Like, I don't know. Join Pixelgasm. That's definitely gonna be what he goes to. French fries. I'll get a two dollars off deal. I'll join Pixelgasm if you make a full track. <laughs> if I make a full track. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, to like, prove that you're serious. Know, <laughs> Good luck with that. Wait, you know, wait, wait you know, if you're really worried about the coronavirus, you can stockpile Invermectin. It's like this fucking like horse tranquilizer or no it's not a tranquilizer oh what horse tranquilizer you can stockpile horse jizz no 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 it's like spread it all over everything it, it, like see check it out it inhibits the replications of SARS-CoV-2 in vitro it, inhib so, it inhibits sarcasm that would be good see check it out no 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 I want to know about it yeah yeah thanks for the link but yeah my you can, like, like you can get some on eBay for eight dollars right now and like there's some other dude trying to sell it for nine hundred and ninety nine dollars a tube. Like I think like I wonder if the stockpile's gonna short out and everybody's gonna want it. What is it? Wait, what is it? It's like a horse dewormer, dude. But you know. Is it hormone? No, it's like it's like a horse dewormer or it'll kill scabies or, you know, parasites. So it's one of the few things that works that'll kill the virus? It's, it, it says it'll inhibit the replication of the virus. A 5,000 reduction of in virus in 48 hours. Yeah. I don't know, though. I mean, I mean, you guys are pretty healthy. You don't really have anything to worry about. All right, well, I, mean, so, I, mean, yeah, I actually day, think I need your help. It's good to know for, like, our parents, whoever lives with their parents. Yeah. I mean, I mean, Dave is probably the worst. Like most susceptible to the coronavirus out of anybody, right? I will like, have asthma. Oh, he smokes. But my immune system is fine. But wait, do you still smoke cigarettes too? Yeah. Oh man, yeah, yeah. No, I think you're the worst off out of any of us, dude. Asthma yeah. and cigarettes, yeah. And then you would confuse the coughing with like asthma and stuff like that. Well, it all is right. combined go with all the lungs. Yeah. I gotta do the do. Alright, go do that. I'm trying to figure out my Reaper. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, go do it like right now to get my mouth to do. I'm gonna do the do to do. I'm gonna do it. With right. my do. 
All right, do it. Do what to do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay here. Dude, was that like a, an advertisement for Mountain Dew right there? <laughs> Whip everything's an advertisement. Yeah, Spacey, wait, no, Toby, you're the guy who's getting paid. Wendy's paid you, then Mountain Dew. Nobody like, how much are they paying you? That's what I want to know. Because I know you owe Spacey, like, hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's all about because you, like, advertise shit on his fucking channel. Motherfucker. About to get fucking late, bitch. I'm gonna advertise some shit. The American dollar. It has some dumbass president on the face of it. Why shouldn't every dollar have Trump's face on it? Cause he's a great president, yo. Great president. Wait, I can't even press play on this. Oh, wait. Dude, how many, how many grams of Kratom do you usually take? Oh, no, like... Oh, I need to go to the preference and see what every dose. So, uh, I'm up to, like, probably, like, 12 grams a day. I was gonna take 7 grams in one dose. You think that's too much? Uh, no. You can take, like, an ounce at once. Like, if you want to get, to like, the really heavy effects. But yeah, you should so, be taking... So, my output from Reaper to... Just measure it by your itching. If you're itching, you're officially going to be high. If you're trying to get sedated, you need to take, like, over 7 grams. Like, 12 grams. That's what I read when I was researching. Yeah, I read, like, less is more. I'm, I'm taking seven grams, but I should take more than seven grams. Well, if you're taking, like, Dude, one to three grams, grams, you'll get, like, a stimulant effect. But if you take, like, over seven grams, you get, like, sedative effects. Yeah, stimulant effect is legit. So I can be, like, lazy in bed, and then all of a sudden I'll sit up on my computer and do something cool like this. I feel like I'm going to choke pretty bad on this thing. Dude, just chug water, just chug, chug, chug. Wait, 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 wait. Just like, put the bottle in the back of my mouth, and then you start chugging it, or it's not all, not all. Set mine into like two or three chunks, and throw like a third of the powder into your mouth, yeah, and then swallow them. You don't do it enough. Uh, well, that's a good option, too, but uh, first wipe your mouth, and then. Take a spoonful and put it in your mouth, but don't put it in the back of your throat. That's where you're coughing. Put it like near the front of your tongue, and then just chug, chug, chug. Just chug it. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, like, it'll turn into like a little turd. It's not gonna not like. It's not gonna stay a powder. It's not gonna make you cough. It's like the cinnamon challenge, dude. I'm gonna like cough a bunch out. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Dude, I've, I've done that. It sucks. I mean, like, hey, 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 muscle spoon, how's it going, muscle spoon? Da 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 da
Yeah, I don't hear anything from or any Ableton on your end. I can hear you. something and like started playing something and it immediately disrupted what we were doing and I realized we were in the flow of 
the universe within this space-time continuum. And Toby is from, like, alternate space-time continuums, and he was like, check it out. And it was like an in immediate disrupt. I couldn't really figure out why I loved that so much, because I, I mean, it, it kind of pissed me off at first. I was like, oh, I was in the flow. Now I gotta, like, holy shit, like, I was, like, shaking from it, you know? But now I have to figure out what I'm listening to now. I figured out Toby's from a different space-time continuum. Dude, can I actually, like, I kind of want to eat these pork rinds. I don't know if I should, though. Wait. Dude, this could be, like, the new Octacker record, right? Oh, did you know all attack our streams on Twitch now? Really? Just do the coronavirus thing, or like they always had? Uh, they started before the coronavirus, <laughs> but they have like a radio Dude, show. That's cool. I respect that. Why? Well, it's kind of funny though. They had like the jump on everybody else. You know, if you were streaming before the whole it's coronavirus thing. But they put a four on the, instead of a. Makes me think, is it really Autecker? Like, it is, it's confirmed because, like, they have a radio show on Mixler, okay, and then they, they're doing visuals for the radio show. That and, like, awesome. and the dude from Autecker, like, posts in the chat on Mixler, that's like a radio station. So, it's, nice. it is, it's Autecker. That's fucking badass. They're from Germany, right? Hot No, they're like, uh, like Great Britain, I think. Or I don't know. Norway, Norwegian? No, they're like Great Britain, I think. I don't know. about redoing or re like starting to start live streaming again then I realized like a lot of celebrities are doing it now so there's a lot less of a potential audience base well uh, celeb <clears throat> every time celebrities start streaming on Twitch it's like people don't really care like they're, they're, people aren't really into celebrities on Twitch some are, it depends, I mean, it goes to Instagram. Well, because celebrities already, like, have so much more they could be doing. Twitch is more for people that are, like, not, like, already, like, super rich and famous. Right. YouTube is more for the, either the select group that have a huge following or... Right, I consider just streaming to YouTube because it has a higher quality audio. Oh, than Twitch? Yeah. That's one of the reasons why Chris J went over there. He was on Twitch for a minute. And he realized he could just focus on one outlet. And build do, you know, do you know what the audio quality is on YouTube? I think it's as high as you want it to be. <clears throat> 320? Wow. No, I think it's like 256 AAC, which is comparable to 320. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, it's, I know it's higher than, than Twitch. At yeah, because like 256 I mean, AAC is basically 320 MP3. <laughs> but yeah, I think you can go as high as you want, basically. I mean, it'd be dumb to go like 320 AAC. Well, so I should raise my audio in OBS then, so I'm higher quality on uh, on YouTube. So I'm only like 160, I think. Either way, though, because at 160, I mean, the majority of viewers that view 
have a live streamer on their phones. So 160 is going to be like, you know, higher than that ain't going to make much of a difference on the phone. Well, those streams are archived forever. And someone might be watching on headphones or yeah. uh, with their PA yeah, setup. Might have, like, the real viewers are watching on like high fidelity systems. They have a big screen and they have a fucking high quality speaker. You know, but well, a lot of times people are just like mobile or like doing shit around their house and they just have it on their phone or on a tablet. Yeah. yeah. But sometimes you have like it all set up in your studio and stuff and like. Nice Twitch PA and everything. It's, on, it's like underground, still kind of. Yeah, dude, it's so underground. It's owned picture, by Amazon, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's an Amazon streaming service too, is there? But... Uh, Twitch. Dude, Amazon owns Twitch, dude. Yeah, Amazon owns Twitch. Do they? Yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Amazon is fucking buying shit out, huh? How do they not pay taxes again? How do they not pay taxes? No, they well, no, well, how do they not pay taxes? Pretty easy. You incorporate your business in another country or some tax haven. Yeah. Because I know Amazon sellers, they be paying taxes. Yeah, but Amazon, let's see. Let's see, what what's the deal? So, it's funny, it's like... So Amazon will not pay federal income tax for the second year in a row. And it's funny, though. It says President Donald Trump has criticized the company for this, yet he reduced the corporate tax rate, making it even easier for large companies to pay less. Yeah, I mean, he wants to make the rich people richer because they're going to mm-hmm. help fund his getting reelected. So let's see. Why is he attacking? They're getting... So, this, uh, so they use a variety of tax credits and tax exemptions that are legal and built within the U.S. federal tax code. Research and development tax credit, which allows them to deduct some of the costs of new investments. And a big one for the past year was the ability to deduct stock-based compensation of executives. What pissed me off at the beginning was the got rid of the Freedom of Information Act that Obama put into place. Mm-hmm. And that pissed me off and at a certain point like I turned the um, I have an, I had an um, I have TTT bot that told me every time a, a bill was passed I turned it off because it pissed me off so much I was like alright I'm not gonna fucking listen to it anymore okay. but what pissed me off recently uh. was that he rolled back the CO2 emissions Laws. Okay, I'll be back. Like the smog back. checks, like you get easier smog check, but but I watched uh, a documentary checks. that showed. Yes, yes. But I guess the, yeah, that's for the environment. I watched a documentary on HBO called uh, Ice on Fire, and they showed how actually the a lot of the clean or some of the clean energy. Um, technologies that we have today are more profitable than oil and definitely more profitable than coal. And it's just a matter of time before the rich people realize that and start investing in it. And like Trump in 2016 was talking about coal, clean energy, and they showed in like 2017, 2018, it like even just the solar panels and the wind turbines surpassed the profitability of coal. And we're actually now surpassing like the profitability of oil. So it's all about cars that don't run on gas now. For like the general public, but they're they have some stuff that's able to like 
save us from the CO2 emissions shit that we've done. Like there's a synthetic plant that they figured out how to create that generates more oxygen than regular plants. So I mean the science is going to catch up. But the, but the real problem is the uh, what's that other gas that is dangerous? The methane. Like if we get like a little bit too hot then all that methane gas that's frozen right now like a lot of it's in Alaska. Yeah I'll be back in a bit. It, when it hits a melting point then there's no way to really roll that back. There's no way to be like, oh, we'll be having figured it out yet anyway. I think we might be able to. I mean, science can do a lot of things. That's for damn sure. I think we'll figure out a way to live in harmony with nature. That's what we were meant to do. So the, the Native Americans really had at it, like, down to the basics of you take from the earth and you give back. And that was like, I guess centuries ago. Now you got to prepare out some shit in order to save not only ourselves but the rest of the planet. But I gotta go get some fucking soda now. Disconnect my phone right now. So, can you still hear me? I can hear you. Toby left. He said he'd be back. Okay. I want to figure out. Uh, I have to go into manage sound devices. Okay. Going to VB Hi Fi cable for my Reaper. So if I go to VB. Okay, I see this disabled. Those are input devices. Um, wait a second, how did I do this before?
Hi-Fi cable, right click. Properties. And then listen to this device. Okay. So can you still hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Let's see if this works. Does that work? Yeah, I can still hear you. I mean, did you hear that loud ass sound that just played? No. Okay. Or play like a constant sound. But no, I didn't hear it. Oh, Reaper was updated. I don't know it as well now. I'm gonna have to do some fucking. Alright, now this should. So I'm sending that to Hi Fi Cable. I'm listening to that. Um... I'm not sure exactly how to. Can work up on going down that plank, plunk, plunk, plunk. Chicken walk up on going, plunk, and can plunk on plunk. So I selected my input as hi fi cable. Yeah, I don't need to do that. Say, listen to that one. So properties. Listen. Okay, so it says listen. Playback through device. Oh, wait. Okay, so I got a. Uh, Speakers much too out, then I'll hear it. Wait, let me just try this. Check one, two.
I see my microphone is coming through, but it's not selected. So my default device is the hi-fi cable output. Of course then you should be able to hear this, but you do not. Right? Nope. Damn. Yeah. Nice. I got some like inverted echo trace inside of my lines. for all okay you got a mode two oh that's weird my when I go to mode two I don't even see the virtual cable as a prefer as a Oh yeah, I need to set up that synchronous audio router. Damn it. Hold on. So ask him for all. I have Jack router. Okay. Good Jack router. Yeah, that was the one I need to set up. So Jack router with synchronous audio router. That's. So the Mo2 won't work with um, virtual cable. Uh, I don't know. In Ableton, I, I couldn't. If I'm using Ableton, I can't use the the virtual cable. You can only use one interface in Ableton, yeah. and then when you try to use a virtual cable, like that, that's the interface. You have to use that as the interface. So, as far yeah. as I'm aware. Sucks. But that's just an Ableton. Uh, but like for the rest of your, for everything else, it's probably I don't know. I don't fucking know. It looks like it's the same situation for Reaper. Uh, 
Maybe there's like a working router or something. I don't know. I just found synchronous audio router oh, error opening. Okay, so yeah, I didn't get that shit working. Oh, I have to run something first. What is it? Oh my god, it's been like a year since I've been... Okay, so I gotta run Jack port audio first. Uh, so let me close Reaper. Yeah, it would be great if I could get this running so I could jam with you. Well, why don't you just do what I do? You have the same interface that I have. So what do you do? Oh, you run an output to the input? I run the master output from my Motu into the main inputs. And then I run other outputs into the speakers. So you basically just route the output into the input. Okay. And you can get it to work in Ableton. So you can hear the audio coming through. But careful not to, you gotta route it so it's not a feedback loop. So you'd route your, you'd show external input one and two in Ableton to output three and four, which for your speakers. Okay. But if you're not using speakers, then it doesn't Modern matter. Modern headphones. Yeah, so that doesn't matter. So, okay. But you can still check in Ableton to see if it's coming through. But that, that should do it. So do you run them into your mic inputs or? Yeah, the, the two mic inputs on the front. All right, I'm, I'm doing this, although I think this is like a... <laughs> this is like a ghetto route. So I did that. I think both Sergio and Tobias have left us. I think Tobias said he'd be back though, but he might have fallen asleep. Or he said he was going to go to sleep. to make a channel. I 
everything's different in the new Reaper. Oh, yeah. Thank you. 
Friends about to do a live set on a Twitch channel. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna go watch that. But I might be back later tonight. 